So this morning, I was wondering why subliminals work on and off for me. Like, they work sometimes. And my movements can be automatic. The things I learn from the subliminals, the things I see, they happen. But sometimes I get bored and they don't work. And I'm just like, when are these going to work? So I did some research this morning. Research. Yay. And... Apparently, the reason LSD works when it comes to your subconscious and subliminals is because it kind of sh speeds up your brain, but lowers your conscious mind. But there, are, I, I also learned there are ways to not use LSD and still get the best effects you can get with subliminals, which I didn't know existed. I've listened... I do listen to alpha waves, but I wasn't aware that alpha and theta waves let your brain go into a state where it absorbs any um, subliminals. And I, I mean the visual ones, not the audio ones, where there's a lot of fast voices talking. <coughs> I suggest... If you're trying to change your eye color with biokinesis, Photoshop the eyes that you want. Photoshop the eyes that you want on your face. And while you're listening to theta or alpha waves, just look at the picture. Because the more, the more you train your, uh, like, subconscious mind to believe a certain thing, the more it will automatically do that. You won't have to think about it anymore. It will just be reality. When we're kids, our brains are constantly in theta and alpha waves all the time. Once we reach about age six to seven, our conscious mind is more developed and we go into a permanent beta state, which is overly thinking about everything. It's good to think, but when you go to work or when you <coughs> overthink, you have anxiety, you have depression. And the reason kids don't have that, some do, because they're growing up situations, but the reason kids don't have that is because they got like a free ride. They don't have to really do anything. They don't have to get a job. They don't have to work. They don't have to, they're not in relationships. It just, it, it doesn't affect them as much because they're free. But when we grow up, we have all these rules. We have all these things that we have to follow because society wants us to follow them. Not because we have to, because we're, trained, we're brainwashed subliminally by media, mostly just media, and our politicians and everything, to be a certain way. When really, when you watch television, your brain goes into a theta state, which is the slightly awake, slightly asleep, I mean alpha. Your brain goes into an alpha state when you watch television. If you want to listen to a Theta, theta is the point of almost asleep but still awake. Alpha is the point of awake and asleep at the same time. That's why when TVs give off alpha waves, your brain is absorbing all the imagery you're seeing from cartoons, TV shows. Blackie, stop. This dog, he keeps hitting the trash can so I'll open the door. Just open it anyways. Here. Okay. He turns around. He's like, why didn't he come with me? He's bored. Everyone's still asleep, and it's like 8.30. I woke up at 6. I always wake up early, because I go to sleep early. Because I never used to do that. Because if you don't go to sleep early, and you're playing on your phone, or playing online games, which I used to do all the time... 
you're going to fall asleep by 12 or 1 and wake up with a migraine because you didn't, your body didn't recover from the previous day. I enjoy giving people this useful information so they can put it into effect and actually do these things. trying to drink as much baking soda water as possible <coughs> because when you put baking soda in your water it not only alkalines it to eight look at the alkalinity scale it alkalines it to eight pH level and it neutralizes stomach acid so you don't get acid reflex yeah it's good so that's all I wanted to say is that one last thing we kind of go into this mode since as kids we're always in a theta alpha state that when we watch television and it puts us into an alpha state we're kind of our subconscious is rec recollect re recollect i can't say that fucking word recollecting remembering our kids kid like state so when we watch tv we feel more relaxed because we feel more like when we did when we were kids makes sense makes complete sense yes so i'm gonna end video now and share my videos yeah bye